Police are investigating allegations the publisher of a book of Nicola Sturgeon's speeches has committed fraud. Sandstone, run by Robert Davidson, a nationalist and SNP supporter, was given £120,000 in the 12 months leading up to the publication of Ms. Sturgeon's book, which was promoted during May's Holyrood election. Keith Charters, managing director of book firm Strident Publishing, wrote to the First Minister warning of concerns over Sandstone. His subsequent police complaint, now the subject of an investigation, involves allegations of wrongdoing directed at both the publisher and he. As well as the £120,000 of grants given last year, police are probing £175,000 of loans agreed with the company in 2019 which are all understood to have been drawn down. Over the last 15 years Sandstone has benefited from over £500,000 of public money when grants from Creative Scotland are also taken into account. The publisher is accused of making false statements about the number of people employed. He is alleged to have wrongly recorded the location of the firm which increased its eligibility for financial support. Mr Charters alleged that he gave the firm a funding score which suggests they were based outside Inverness, increasing its eligibility for support. Speaking to the Daily Record, Mr Charters said, to date over £500,000 of public money has been used to prop up Sandstone Press. That includes the £120,000 it received in the 10 months prior to announcing it would be publishing a book of Nicola Sturgeon's speeches in the week of the Scottish Parliament election. It is deeply concerning that, when we blew the whistle on how he had provided Sandstone with that £120,000 when we provided the First Minister with detailed evidence of suspected wrongdoing, the response of her officials was to vilify us for daring to challenge on the basis of the evidence.